Hey there guys, Black Panther here and welcome to a very special video indeed. So, today we're gonna go back a little bit. Uh, for those that don't know, my channel didn't start out as a racing game channel. And uh, it was originally just gonna be like a multi-game channel thing. I uploaded loads of different stuff. Before that, there was a whole other story. It was going to be a multi-game channel, multiplayer, like multiple person channel. Matthew was going to be on the channel. So it's another friend. It was going to be a news channel. It was going to be everything. But it was basically going to be a multi-game channel. Until I started playing Need for Speed The Run. Now, I played a little bit of it. I played it a little bit late, but I still played a little bit of it. And um, people enjoyed it. So I did more Need for Speed than I did everything else. And it slowly evolved into what it is now. A racing game channel with a few extra bits in there every now and again like gta or something anyway to the point most wanted 2012 came out now <laughs> it was not the greatest game in the world it was not the greatest need for speed it was not close um i think everyone can agree there but it, it you know just to be clear it wasn't terrible but it wasn't need for speed right so um, we can't, that's when I originally started to go. You know what? This is this is not right. This is not this is not Need for Speed, and basically express my feelings. And then we went on to uh, Rivals, which was even more like what? <laughs> what? I mean, it it was still Need for Speed, but it was more like the old Need for Speeds that not many people really enjoyed that much, and it was less of it. Like, it didn't feel like it was a next-gen game in any way, and to be fair, on Ghost Sign, it was their first game, and they were developing the studio while doing so, and they had a really short development time and all these kind of things, but inevitably, we paid the same amount for that product as we did every other game that came out that year, the year before, the, a few years ago, and it just wasn't up to scratch compared to a lot of games. But uh, after that, Ghost took a, took a little break, as you may remember, and they listened. I didn't expect them to ever listen like they have. Just thinking back to it, the stuff we've said, you know, everything we've asked for, most of the stuff we've asked for is basically here in Need Speed 2015. They took an extra year off because they wanted to put more time into thought, the thought process of the game and get it working properly and make it basically everything we want. Because let's be clear, a car game with this many cars, so let's say it's got like 50 something cars, and it has body parts galore for every single thing. Imagine how much much time that's going to take. Like normally to make a car and then like, release it and you know in Forza for example they make a car and they, you can put the Forza wing on it that sort of thing. That's basically it. Um, in the time it takes them to probably make a full body kit for that one car, Forza would have made another car. So you know it kind of balances out. I would prefer less cars with more customization than more cars with less customization. That's that's my preference, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people will agree with me on that. <clears throat> but the open world map, it's open world obviously, and it has all drive. And I actually asked for all drive to stay. It was a feature that didn't work very well on Rivals. It would lag the game. It would cause issues in where the police would <laughs> just ram you and start a police chase for no bloody reason. And it would just, it wouldn't work very well. But now they fixed it and they've made it work and it works really, really well. I can go, you know what, let's race here with my friend, whatever. And obviously, they've added all the iconic cars back. They've added a story back. They've added handling tuning. So even if you liked the drift handling, it's still there for you. And that's probably the best bit about this game. Ghost have not just gone, you know what? We're going to listen to these guys, which would have been, you know, would have been me so praising them. Let's be, let's be honest here. I would have been like, this is amazing. This is incredible. They've listened. But they, they didn't just listen. They also thought <laughs> before they just acted. They knew that a lot of people liked the rival mechanics. Now, let's be fair. There's probably more people that prefer the older mechanics and that and the older like gameplay and you know the story and that sort of thing. But there are still people that prefer just jump in with your favorite car and play and get out the cops after you and don't progress and that and that kind of stuff. And you can do that. You can play the game stock cars. You can you know, play the whole game without touching the upgrades at all when it comes to, like, anything. Like, you don't have, you could sell your car and get a high performance car and beat the game with it if you get to a certain race that needs a certain amount of horsepower, that sort of thing. And what I'm trying to get at is, <laughs> thank you. Not just to Ghost, obviously, because Ghost have listened to us, but thank you to everybody at home that commented, 
that liked, that shared, that just anything towards me for speed. Like any any comment on any video, I'm pretty sure Ghost would have seen it, or you know Ben would have looked around on Reddit or in the comment section of a video discussing me for speed. You know, the, these guys listen, listen, and that's incredible because I never thought of that. You know, I never thought it was gonna, I, I was gonna, you know, we were gonna get what we wanted, but we did on an incredible scale like not just the, they didn't just do a couple of things we want we did they did everything we wanted but also balanced it with the things that people they did amazing so again um be sure to share your your thoughts down below but the time is here my friends need for speed is just around the corner and it's the game honestly we've all waited for since some people will say underground most wanted carbon i'd say undercover to be fair because undercover was a pretty good game 2008 which is still a <laughs> a damn long time but it's time for need for speed to uh, regain the throne in the racing genre like it once had and uh well we'll see how it goes anyway what are you most excited about for need for speed make sure to let me know down in the comments and again Thank you to everybody here, everybody at Ghost, everybody at EA. Just, it's incredible. My logo's in the game. <laughs> Shameless play. It's, it, I still can't. It's, it's, <laughs> it's coming out soon. Anyway, I'm going to round the video before I just go to the end of the whole rest of the video. Thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a like if you did enjoy. And I will see you on the streets of Intro Bay. Oh, gadget! Peace.